we're gonna make something pretty cool and I'm hoping that that y'all will like it okay here we go I'm gonna show y'all something really cool that we're gonna make I'm just gonna jump right in this is a Dollar Tree these are Dollar Tree um, I have glued this together with my wood glue from bum, 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 Dollar Tree Ooh, right um, yeah so I can take these guys off right now um, palettes y'all palettes so that's what it's called palettes y'all know I need a little help with my words right that's why I just love you guys you help me so much okay so we're gonna paint those I've got me some um, Dollar Tree contact paper here that I like to put under my under my um, projects when I paint I was using um, I was using something else and it was kind of an expensive way to do it so I got to remember to do it this way and not use my good my good 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 stuff all right so just tore off a little bit of that we're going to paint the palette and I'm using the uh the same chalk paint because I'm cheap and I haven't gone back to buy any $8.99 y'all but like I said I use a coupon so um I'm pretty sure this was Hobby Lobby yes this is Hobby Lobby that is so sweet. Mine came um, yesterday. Our daughter is a, she's a real live artist, y'all. Like, she went to Savannah College of Art and Design, and she has a studio, and she was working on a, on a client's project, which, y'all, oh my gosh, it's beautiful. It's a painting of the client's horse. But anyway, she needed to, um, to deliver that, that painting, so we had the girls yesterday and y'all I went to uh we had our grandkids last week too but um we had all of them all of them but my daughter came every time her girls came she came too so that she could help take care of all the kids because we got five total and three of them are from the savannah area and it just oh it gives us so much joy to have them here and it was really I mean, you're exhausted and you're sad all at once when it's time for them to leave. You know, you're like, oh my gosh, we're going to miss them so much. But then, but then you're just kind of like, don't even, we didn't even speak hardly most of the way home from uh, Macon. We met mama halfway and my husband said, Ninja Man said, you know, we haven't said a word and that's unusual for him to point that out. Because we can, we can drive for days without speaking. But anyway, well, he can. You know, I can. But, um, <laughs> but yeah, so he's like, we haven't said a word. And I'm, and I'm thinking, that's because it's so quiet. <laughs> so we just rode in the quiet. But it's a little bit of guilt feeling when you're like, whew, that's, you know, that was a thing. Um, but, I mean, you know, we don't have kids in the house every day. But it's so wonderful to have them here. Okay, so this is technically painted. Now, will I go back and touch it up? Yes. But, you know, I'm going to go in between all the, little, all the little slats here. I glued two of them together, as I was saying, and I put my little Dollar Tree. These are Dollar Tree clamps right here. Put them on. And y'all know I'm a Stampin' Up! demonstrator, right? So I was talking to one of my customers a few minutes ago and uh, putting in an order for her. And um, and I was thinking, you know what, maybe maybe I'll eat lunch after, after my live. So if y'all hear some grumbling going on, it could be my tummy. <laughs> okay, so I'll probably put another coat on that. Then I'm going to bring this out. Again, Dollar Tree. It was $1.00. You want to look for one with glass in it. There's a lot of them, a lot of little frames with things in it and all that. And it sounds silly to tell you that, but I've got a few frames back here. This was the only one I had that actually had glass in it. And I do like the, the finish on this. It's, you know, it's kind of neat, but it doesn't match exactly. So we're going to work on that. I'm going to take this out and they're easy to bend. I'll take this part out take out these people that I don't know. Do y'all know them? I don't know them, but they got a cute little dog and a kid. Notice I saw the dog first. Sorry. Okay. Going to take this out, set it to the side and y'all just, 
I hope I don't break it. All right. Now we're going to paint. I'm going to stand this up here. Okay. Now we're going to paint this. See how well I do. I don't know. I've never painted it before. But I do want it to match my, um, my palettes. My palettes. So, y'all, I got my hair bones cut. As y'all can tell, I got itty-bitty hair now. But guess what? I think this is the way that Kathy Bow's going to be because, um, y'all, I'm really a lot more comfortable with the shorter hair. But, y'all, my neck gets cold, and I'm thinking, come on now. But, yeah, uh, Ninja Man and I, we were sitting outside last night on the front porch because, y'all, it's beautiful. I'm in Noonan, Georgia, and I'm telling y'all what, it was one of the prettiest evenings we've had in a while. And we were watching our pastor live on YouTube, and I had to go in and get get uh, one of those winter knitted scarf things to put to put around the back of my neck. I got too cold. Okay. Um. Thank you, Dana. Thank you. Thank you. I kind of think this is who I am now. Lady with the short hair. I always said when I got old, I'd never look like an old lady, but. You know, here we are. But the good thing is, I'm not, I've never considered myself a vain person, which is good, because it wouldn't do me a bit of good to be vain. Um, I'm just like, hey, this is what it is, you know? And I've gone off in my leggings before, and I do know better than that, but I still do it. But you know, we, nobody, nobody, I'm not, I'm not out there fishing, right? But I still want to look nice from time to time. But I'm not going to, like, let me tell y'all this. I used to work in corporate America. I worked for Coca-Cola and Pepsi-Cola. And I've been a writer for many, many years. I wrote for the um, Savannah Morning News and others. And, I mean, there was times that the job called for pantyhose, okay? Well, I'm an anti-pantyhose person now. Like, I don't even own a pair. If somebody has a funeral, they're going to go with these legs right here. Because, uh-uh, not even doing it. All right, so see what we're what we're looking at doing here. We're looking at putting this here. And is it still wet? Yes, a little bit, a little bit. The paint is still a little bit wet, but we're not ready for it anyway. i got to plug in my glue gun. Goodness, y'all. I, I kind of look in the mirror and I see Mama. And some days I'm like, now, Mama... You need to get out of that mirror. And other days I'm like, oh, mama, I miss you. You know, it depends. It depends on the mood. I'm just going to wipe that off just a wee bit because it's it got a little crazy. It got a little crazy. Yeah, we're going to glue that together, but that'll be in a minute. Okay, so y'all, I actually did you a short video that I was trying to upload here, but I can't. It, it, it didn't it didn't go. But here's what it's about. It is about this little die cutting machine called a Cricut Joy, okay? And this is it. And it, I need to move that glass before I do something crazy. Okay. It's a little die cutting machine and you can cut cardstock or vinyl or whatever. So I did a whole little short video that I was just going to go click, click, click and show y'all, but it didn't show up. So I can't show you now. But anyway, I die cut this B, okay? This is vinyl, and this is um, transfer tape right here, and this is the sticky side of the vinyl. So I, I really I really was planning on showing you all the things, but it just didn't work out, y'all. It just didn't. There we go. Okay, I have to put my things back where they were. All right, so let's clean our piece of glass. I am prepared. Anybody else that's here, please say hello so we'll know you're here. That's the only, I mean, you're not going to be charged extra. <laughs> Nothing like that. Oh, hey, Jan. Oh, thank you, Jan. Yes, I love the bees. And y'all, I was going to do words because I love to see in my house the words, but first pray. But guess what? I've said it so many times. It's all over the house. Well, not really. It's all over my studio. I've got a couple of things in here that say, but first pray. 
And I really like that because I have to be reminded that, you know, I need to pray about all this first. The bumblebee is so pretty. And it was a free Cricut um, file. And, I mean, do you need the Cricut Joy? No. It is a, the Cricut Joy, I'll be honest with you, it is a luxury item, I think. You don't have to have one. Do you need a regular Cricut? Heck yeah, yeah. Um, but you can go on, you can go on Pinterest and see all the things with Cricut if you don't know much about it. Now, this is our glass from our um, picture frame, okay? And I've cleaned it with Windex, and now i got to get my head in it. I'm so sorry. But I got, I, actually, let me, let me pull it back a wee bit. Hold on. Please hold. Okay, so I'm putting my little bumblebee on here, or yellow jacket, or whatever he wants to be. And this is one of my tools. I even, on that little video that I can't upload, I mean, I can't access from my device right now, I showed you my tools, y'all, and this is one of them. I mean, do you have to have this? No, you can use a credit card. But there's other tools that come with it. Okay, so when you peel this off, you want to go at an angle. And sometimes you have to kind of dance it back and forth. But this guy, he's he's being pretty good. So I don't need to do that. And this is the transfer tape here. Hopper, yes, you need your cricket. You need it. You need it. I mean, let me tell you. I mean, there's as many guys out there doing cricket things as there are girls. It's just, it's just a really neat thing. And I mean, I used to, like, people would ask me to do certain things to put on their car and stuff. And... And I did them. And, you know, you can make a little money off of that. You really can. Okay, I've got a little, I got a little bubble right there. But, you know what, I'm not going to worry about the bubbles right now. Well, I guess I am. Look at me worrying with it. Um, but you'll get, you might get a few bubbles. And if I took more time, I probably could get these out with um, just a wee bit more work. Okay, so this, this is our little design. Isn't he pretty? Okay. And now we're going to put him in here. And this, the, the vinyl is on the outside. Now, if you had, if you wanted, you could, you could do anything. You don't have to do a B. Um, you could do any kind of design you want. There we go. We're going to just put him directly in. We're not even going to put those people back in there because, you know, cute dog and all, I don't know them. Lindell, you need a cricket. Lindell. <laughs> gimmick. Another gimmick. I know. Okay, I don't like these little things, so we'll figure out what to do about that later. All right, we're not going to worry about it right now. I can cut them off, but I just don't want to take your time. So we are going to put this like this. You know what? I do want to cut them off. Please hold. I got to do that because they, they be ugly. They be ugly, and this is too purdy too pretty. All right, hold on, hold on. Let's don't get excited. Let me find my little cutting tool. Guess who I got this from? Mm -hmm. Ninja Man. I said, can I borrow something like, and he brought it to me and I never gave it back. I'm telling you, sometimes, oh dear. And see, now, now I'm getting in trouble because it's not cutting. Oh, y'all. Oh, oh, but it will fold. Oh, that, there we go. I can fold it think. Let me try this one. Hold on. We can do this. We can do this. So now that I'm using this, I have to go back and, um, you know what I think I'm going to do for the, just for now, I'm going to put this like this and I'm going to put some hot glue on here because I did turn it on for a reason. I'm just going to hot glue this glass in and I'll worry about these things later, but I don't want them making my, my B not pretty. Right? Here we go. Here we go. Oh dear. Come on. Here we go. So y'all, I'm not even hangry yet, but I'll tell y'all this. I'm hungry. Not hangry. Not yet. Okay. Here we go. Oh, put him in this way. That's right. We're just going to glue him in for now and I'll worry about his little things later. Okay. All right. And I have in my possession... Let's see, Lindell, but you have introduced me to another surface I can go and get from Dollar Tree to use my other newfound direct sales product. <laughs> I 
about Linda. Yes, right? I mean, Dollar Tree, I'm telling you, it's the bomb diggity, bomb diggity. Okay, so I got this little candle, and before my crafting show started, I took the label off, so I cannot tell you what scent it is, but it's pretty fabulous, and it was $5. Now, to me, that looks like Dollar General. Oh, it says maple caramel. Oh, y'all, it smells so good. I love it. Okay, and I mean, I, I just think that's where I got it from, because guess who doesn't go to Walmart? Me. And guess who has been boycotting Target for two years? Me. So it has to be probably Dollar General, because I didn't order it on Amazon. Okay, so we are going to glue this guy. Um, here we go. We'll just put him on with glue, okay? Because it's kind of like a plastic frame. We're just going to glue, glue, glue. And I'm telling you, you need a wedding present or something, y'all. I mean, this is going to be the cutest thing ever. Well, maybe not ever, but dang, it's close to it. So we're just going to hold this on. And if you're out here watching and you hadn't said, hello, please do, so I'll know you're here. Okay, see what we've got now? See this? What a nice little um, welcome home, you know, like somebody just bought a house or something. And you're going to put your candle in it, and it's going to look like this. And you're going to light your candle, and bada bing. How cute is that? Candle palettes, picture frame. Oh, okay. Okay, so I was going to show... I've got my calendar over here of what I'm doing this month on my Kathy Bowes Crafting Show. And I was looking to see if I needed to, um, to show you all something else. But no, this is really and truly, if I was not teaching, it would be a 10-minute project. It really would. And, you know, you can paint it the colors for the person's house or whatever. And let me see... I've got, I've got lighters over here. Let me light my candle and show y'all how pretty it's going to be. How pretty, pretty. I've got my lighters. Everybody's like, why do you have lighters in your studio? Well, you never know. You never know. I don't smoke. I quit smoking when I was uh, 19. I started when I was 13. I know it's bad. It's bad. But I quit when I was 19. So there's that. Come on now. Okay. I've got to get the little, the little doodly do it. Oh dear. Oh, the wick, y'all. There. I, I don't even know. All right, come on now. Oh, oh dear. Oh, it's a big flame, y'all. Okay. Live through that one. Whew. Okay. Oh, y'all. Even with the candle burning. Oh, I don't know if I should tilt it so much, but can y'all, can y'all get an idea? I know what to do. Hold on. <laughs> I know what to do, y'all. Surprise! I know what to do. Here we go. Can you see it burning in there? Little candle. I don't know if you can or not. Oh, let me turn it this way because it's got a lot of wax on it. There we go. Isn't that pretty? And you could, like... Like, somebody's getting married, you can put, like, Boudreaux and Buffy you know, March something, whatever year, right? You could put that on there. Um, we call our home Six Little Acres, and I use a, a chicken logo, and it, and it says Six Little Acres, and then the chickens, and then it says Established um, 2017, because that's when we actually moved here. Um, so that would be cute, something like that. And, I mean, y'all... Isn't it just, isn't it just thinking cute? Cute as a button. Who would love this hopper? Tell me. Tell me who. Tell me who. Tell me who. Because maybe that person needs one. And if, if you want to, um, if you wanted me to mail you one of these, I would have to mail it flat so that, and you'd have to get your own candle. And then you'd have to glue that on because it's not going to mail like this. But um, y'all can let me know. Oh, dear. Y'all, I just put paint on it, but it's okay. I can get it off. Um, yeah, so that's our craft today, y'all. It's super simple. It's super fast. And I'm excited to be able to show you something that goes like that. And 
you know, we got um, $3 in it, except for the candle and the vinyl. Um, but yeah, I mean, you, you can even get like vinyl stuff at the Dollar Tree and put it on there yourself. You know, you can buy little vinyl things. Um, yeah, you can change the vinyl seasonally. This does peel off. It sure does. And you could also, if you want it, you could get, um, and look at the back where I bent those back. That's all I did. And I put, um, I think I might just leave it like this. I put glue down in there, hot glue, and it's holding the glass in pretty good. I better not get too froggy with it. But, um, but yeah, you can, you can get vinyl designs from the Dollar Tree. They've got some, and, and you just want to make sure of the size because I had to measure the inside and make sure that I didn't get too crazy with that. And we're going to be doing some more vinyl things. Let me see when. It looks like March 25th I'll be doing some more vinyls. So I'm going to get a little video so I can show you exactly how that vinyl works and how I cut it out and everything. And hopefully you'll enjoy that. But today's short and sweet. How about that? Y'all have a good day. Thank you again for hanging out with me. And um, Hopper, let me know if you need me to send one of these. I can send one down there. Just send me an address. All right. Love y'all. Toodles.